The European Union may use energy as a bargaining chip in its negotiations with Keir Starmer's Labour government over a new UK-EU fisheries deal. The European Union may target Britain's energy supplies to force Keir Starmer to meet the bloc's demands to keep its rights to fish in UK waters, reports suggest. Under the existing Brexit deal, the bloc's fishermen were permitted to access parts of Britain's coastal seas, but the amount the EU's fishers could take in UK waters was to be slashed by a quarter over five and a half years up to 2026. Brussels wants to keep the deal, but according to reports, the bloc will renegotiate the UK-EU Brexit agreement, known as the Trade and Cooperation Agreement, if Britain allows European Union fishers full access. The Brexit deal expires in 2026, along with the UK's energy agreement with Brussels, which maintained Britain's access to EU gas and electricity markets after the country left the EU in January 2020. Anand Menon, director of the UK in a changing Europe think tank, told The Telegraph, it's no coincidence that the energy and fisheries provisions of the Trade and Cooperation Agreement expire on the same day. He added that fisheries really matter politically in the EU so the bloc will be determined to secure ongoing access to British waters and will be willing to use energy as a bargaining chip. The energy section of the Trade and Cooperation Agreement remains in force until June 30, 2026 and could be extended annually beyond that date. There is a separate agreement on cooperation over nuclear energy, which secures cooperation between the EU and UK over its safe and peaceful uses. Mike Cohen, chief executive of the National Federation of Fishermen's Organizations, told the same publication the Labour government mustn't just accept the continuation of the bad deal struck last time. The European Union's Brexit negotiator, Maro Sefcovic, has already told MEPs that the bloc must secure guaranteed access for fishers after the deal expires.